Howdy, what's up soldiers, my name is Greg FPS, and welcome back to episode number 3 of Elite Gun Class Setups in Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. Today we're going to be taking a look at, in my opinion, the best Elite Gun in Advanced Warfare, and that is the Ball 27 Inferno. This gun is an absolute monster, and as you guys know, the Ball 27 is probably the best gun in the game, or one of the best, and just adding on this additional changes to the gun make it absolutely amazing. So the Inferno has an increased fire rate and also increased handling which makes it really really easy to use the only thing that sucks about it is it has a decrease in mobility but that's not really too too important now when you get into the actual class setup overall it's really really good first you're going to want a suppressor and you're going to need to use primary gunfighter for your attachments suppressor parabolic microphones you can see your enemies around the minimap that are using suppressors and also foregrip just for reduced recoil the fire rate makes it sway a little bit upward so the foregrip really compensates that and makes it a great overall gun when you get into the perks this is really really a great stealth setup this is great for free for all as you can see in this gameplay or if you want to go for DNA bombs or anything like that you can really maneuver around the map without really being seen so I use low pro profile to just stay off the mini maps like usual then blind eye it allows all enemy kill streaks to not be able to see you on the mini map which is really really helpful and this also includes AI so if there's like tracker drones or anything like that they'll stay away from you Next is Blast Suppressor, which doesn't show your exo movements on the minimap, which is really, really helpful. And then Scavenger for going on long gun streaks and things like that. As far as an exo ability, I simply do not use one. I don't think they're effective, and they really aren't needed overall in this class setup. Next, for the exo launcher, I just use a regular frag grenade. It allows me to cook the grenade and shoot it far, far across the map. And I only use two score streaks on this class setup, System Hack and UAV. Honestly, they're the best two for going on long gun streaks and things like that. So overall, guys, this gun is absolutely insane. Like, it is absolutely beast and a half. So I have five basic questions that I've been asking in each and every one of these Elite Gun class setups. The first question is, is this designed for close quarter engagements, long range engagements, or medium range engagements, and how does it perform in each? This gun is in so good that it can perform in every single one of these. As a fast rate of fire for close range, it can shoot really long range and then medium range is just an absolute monster. So overall it's really good. Question number two, is this gun good on small, medium or large maps? It's good on all maps. It, there's no map that it sucks on or suffers. Question number three, what is the best feature and worst feature? The best feature is the camo, the rate of fire, the range, like literally everything about this gun is good. So there's really nothing wrong with it. <laughs> I, I mean, honestly, there's a little bit of sway in the recoil because it shoots faster, but that's about it. And it, like I said, it's compensated using foregrip. Question number four, on a scale of one to 10, 10 being amazing, what would you rate this gun? I'd rate this gun a 10. It is literally the best elite gun in the game. This gun is also very rare. I've only seen one other person have this after playing for about a week and a half. So, I mean, honestly, this gun is absolutely ridiculous. And question number five, is this gun a viable gun to use when going for higher scoring gameplays? Absolutely, this gun is absolutely beast and a half so anyways guys i hope you guys enjoyed elite gun class setups episode number three if you did be sure to drop this video a like one other thing is i'm going to be live streaming on playstation 4 tonight for a couple hours before the far cry midnight release which i'm going to so if you guys want to play and you are on ps4 make sure to hit up the live stream i'm going to be streaming around 8 30 or so so make sure you guys head out there and check it out i will be sure to see you in the stream and say hey how's it going and all that sort of stuff so thanks for watching guys my name is greg fps i'll see you guys later peace out and thank you so much for all the views on these videos they've been absolutely like destroying the view count which is awesome so thanks again guys my name is greg fps peace out we'll see you later